Hey, what's going on guys? So my previous video about two weeks ago that I uploaded uh, on reviewing these environment maps got like 215,000 views in two weeks. That's insane. It just became the second most viewed video on my channel, which is crazy because I've had this channel for like 10 years. So obviously people want to keep um, looking at these stuff, type of stuff. Obviously there's a lot of interest in maps in Unreal Engine 4 and realistic environments. So this is probably going to be one of my money makers right here so we're gonna be taking a look at another map from maui this is the knifer knifer forest right here as you can see uh we're already in here and i increased the resolution to 4k because i do have a separate pc recording this now i i, I don't have the dinosaur anymore which is supposed to one tap which is the 1070 like i did in my previous video of my laptop um the one i have now with the pc is not a dinosaur per se but you know it's probably like bc ish it has like a 360 on it uh so that's what we're gonna be using i'm hoping i can capture this in full 4k for you guys so you can really see what i'm seeing on my screen here Right, so I do have the FPS turned on here, and I'm going to turn off the DLSS for now. So, save that. We're going to be doing the first-person view, and we're going to be doing the uh, third-person view with the orc. Because it's fun, <laughs> I think. Alright, let's jump in. I have the Pi uh, resolution to 4K, so I'm going to press play. Alright, here it is. And let's walk around and there is that boar. Let's try and move around. So let's start with the water here No, no, I'll let you guys start there um, You know say like it's not really realistic. But yeah, I mean it's not too bad It's not gonna be like a triple-a map. I mean you got to think I think there's two people that's making these maps Compared to you know a big studio. So for two people a small team This map right here is I get again one of the best maps you can get from the epic marketplace now i did turn off um motion blur as well because i know some of you guys really don't like motion blur so i did turn that off i mean look at this map crazy right it's absolutely beautiful it can be like a hunting game or an mmo game one day when Blizzard maybe starts deciding to upgrade their wow, it would look like this. Look at these scan assets. They look so good. Alright. Now let's dive into the woods woods. Yeah, I'm hoping this is a little bit better for you guys out there. I know my previous videos were really laggy because I was recording to a laptop and now having two separate systems this should work a little bit better it's just beautiful man Especially for right now with the pandemic, if you want to just go in here and take a walk, because you can't do it in real life, you know. Just walk here for hours. That's crazy. I'm really excited with um, the future of Maui Maps, because this is only going to improve from here. <laughs> you know what I mean? This is just amazing. I would never... I would never be able to make something like this. Not by myself. This is just insanity. And this orc, by the way, if you were wondering, I got it from the Epic Marketplace. So, it's not like he's custom made or anything. I just got him from the Epic Marketplace. Oh, there's a log there. Okay. Okay, so let's go to the first person view now. So let me press escape. And we'll change our world settings here. Let's just go to our first person game mode. And let me turn on the FPS so you guys can see. So I'll disconnect this from now because I'll turn on DLSS here as well so you can see it. Let's just connect this here. So if I press play, the FPS should show up. 
and indeed it does. All right. So here is the first person view. Trying to move it as slow as I can here. There's the boar. It's kind of hanging out. I think the quest says we're going to kill about a hundred of these. All right, let's move around. Pretty cool stuff. Imagine having like a battle royale. I'm getting about 75, 76 in 4K. No, I am recording this in OBS as well. Okay, so let's turn on DLSS. I'm getting about 84. We'll do um, quality first. Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to build that. So let's go to the blueprints. Open blueprint. And let's set the DLSS mode. To quality. Compile and save. And let's press play. Okay. Okay. FPS disappeared. Hang on. Blueprint. It's not letting me follow through it, huh? Let's try it again. There you go. Better. I just had to recompile it. Alright, so here we go. Walk around. 104 FPS. This is set to quality. Wanted 15. Yeah, this time around, my FPS didn't even drop <laughs> close to less than 60, even without DLSS on. It looks like we're getting less than 10 MS, which is pretty good. Notice it, it's a little bit crispier with DLSS on. What's kind of scary to think about is Unreal Engine 5. <laughs> You know, with Unreal Engine 5, as far as I know, you can actually force the entire map to be the highest LOD. Which some of these obviously has LOD still. But can you imagine playing a game when LOD doesn't really matter? Billions of triangles. Oh, that's exciting stuff. Alright guys, well, that's pretty much it. A little walkthrough in the um, Maui Conifer Forest or Conifer Forest available for you guys to get in the Epic Marketplace. Uh, the maps actually do come on sale quite a bit, so just monitor. So you want to learn Unreal Engine 4, but majority of the videos out there are for video game creations. Maybe I can help with that. I just created a beginner's course on how to make a movie inside Unreal Engine 4. In an hour and 40 minutes, I'm going to teach you how to install Unreal Engine 4 to create your very first CG animation. Unreal Engine is the future. 
and this video is the perfect introduction to it.